Hey everybody, it's Brett and this 2024 Jeep Wrangler two-door Rubicon X is stock number 24J308. I am super excited to go over this Jeep today. This thing's got a lot of cool options on it and uh, it also comes with the six-speed manual transmission. It's in my favorite Jeep color of hydro blue metallic. And uh, I'm just gonna go all the way around in this video. Plus it's the Rubicon X, so it has the leather seats and everything. But we're gonna go over all the options and everything that this Jeep has. And if you like the video or learn anything, subscribe to the YouTube channel and uh, click the bell notification so you'll get updated every time I do videos of our vast Jeep inventory here at Summit Auto. Uh, this one comes with a lot of nice options. Like I said, starting off, it does come with the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. Puts out 285 horsepower, 260 foot-pounds of torque. And like I said, it is paired up with the six-speed manual transmission. And you're gonna get 23 miles per gallon on the highway, 17 city for an average of 19 miles per gallon. Starting off with the options on this one, this one does come with the worn 8,000 pound winch. It does come with a synthetic rope here. Also comes with the steel bumpers. I believe those are uh, standard on the Rubicon X package. Of course, the updated grill for 2024, the LED headlamps, running lights, and fog lights. I'm gonna turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. And you also get LED running lights in the fenders here. This one also has the color match fenders, the color match hardtop, and if you wanted to check out the original window sticker, it'll be linked in the description below. We're gonna to get to it in just a second. This one also comes with BF Goodrich All-Terrain TAKO2 tires. These are LT285 70R17 tires. And you can see the tread pattern on there, definitely an all-terrain tread pattern to them. And uh, like the painted and polished aluminum wheels. The center caps are also all updated for 2024. You also get a trail rated badge on the side instead of the um, antenna because they put the antennas in the windshields that are all now Corning Gorilla Glass. You do get a Jeep still climbing up the windshield though and you get those sandals in that plastic shroud there. Also seven slots on that shroud as well. You get the sport hood with the imitation heat extractor, heat extractors on there. And uh, this one does come with the premium rock rails with the uh, kind of steps on them. So that's a really good looking option on here. You get the T50 on the doors. And that indicates that you need the Torx 50 bit to get those off. We did a demo on how to take your doors off. Speaking of doors on this Wrangler, this one comes with the premium dual door group. And uh, that is a $3,550 option. And uh, we're gonna get to that in just a second. It does have the tow package with the receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring, backup parking sensors, LED license plate light and tail lights there. There's a better look at that tread pattern if you want to check that out. But back to that dual door group. So when you get one of these in a two door with the dual door group, this is how they are shipped to the dealership. It comes in a huge box. And I honestly don't even know how you would get that box out of there because it actually goes up into the uh, hard top there. So I don't even know how you'd get those out. I'm sure you'd have to take these off first, slide those out, tip the box a little bit to get it out. But yeah, I'm not even sure. I was gonna take all this stuff out for this video, but I don't wanna wreck anything. So I'm just gonna leave it in there. But that's how it comes. There's absolutely no room. The second row seats are flipped up and uh, it's kind of crazy. You get these seven slots on the back door here. You also get the JL badge with the two door, four door, wheelbase and overall length, as well as the um, distance between the wheels and the outside tread of the tires. Uh, so overall width and then where it's developed and built in. This one of course does have the hard top. We did a demo on how to take your hard top off your two door Jeep Wrangler in a Wrangler exactly this color. If you wanted to check that out, that is in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. And uh, just let me know what you think of this Jeep guys. I think it looks really good. 
and uh, wait till we get to the interior here with the new Rubicon X interior. Enter and go system, heated mirrors. This one does have blind spot monitoring, but the Rubicon X package now gives you the leather bucket seats that are both power. There's the original window sticker. Like I said, we're gonna check that out in just a second. Um, you get the red stitching on the backrest here. Side curtain airbags on the seats. And you also get side curtain airbags up front here. I don't know if you can see that, but it says it right there. And I was asked if they have side curtain airbags in the back, but I really can't check that because of those boxes back there. I believe it does. Actually, yep, it says it right there. So side curtain airbags right up here. So, but you can see just how much they have packed this Jeep full. Uh, it goes right to the back seats and there's absolutely no room. Um, but back to that interior, you get the power seats on both sides. This one does have the Mopar all weather floor mats. They have a topographical design on them. They look really good. New for 2024, you get this little badge with the Gladiator and Wrangler back to back there. This one has kind of the Gore-Tex dash finish with the red trim and accents. It does have the power mirrors, power locks. And let's hop inside, check out the miles, or not really the miles, but the dash and the instrument cluster and all the options this one has to offer on the interior. You do get the seven inch LCD display with the little Wrangler climbing on the bottom there, animation. Digital speedometer, you get a compass display. And uh, this one comes with the leather wrapped steering wheel with the red stitching, cruise controls, adaptive cruise controls, Bluetooth and information center controls and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. This one comes with the Uconnect 12.3 inch Uconnect 5 radio. So it does have AM, FM and Sirius XM radio capabilities as well as Bluetooth, USB and AUX jacks and Alexa. You also have your climate controls here, which includes your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls and your dual climate controls on there. You get your different apps on here. I'm not gonna go through everything, but just kind of show you a lot of this stuff is just links to different parts of the radio. It does have Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. I believe those are both wireless now. And then you get your forward camera right here, which is pretty sweet. So that is basically a graphical representation of those yellow lines there of where your tires are going to be so that you don't hit any rocks or um, tree limbs or you know tree trunks or anything while you're on the trail so you don't pop a tire or anything like that. You can check out your backup camera, which they've made those crystal clear. And then you get the Jeep kind of picture on that side to cover up the rest of the area. This one also has off-road pages which you get your steering angle, your transfer case, sway bar if it's connected or disconnected, axle lock and rear axle lock if those are on or off, latitude, longitude, altitude, accessory gauges, pitch and roll, and your front camera once again. And you can clean that with the camera cleaner there. Down here are your more, actually, let's finish the apps here. Um, then you get your system apps here and then other. So a lot of cool stuff you can do with that radio. Obviously the upgraded dash. With the wider radio, you get these smaller air vents there instead of the circle air vents that used to be on the sides of the radio. They've also changed the top part here. You get two kind of coin holders, I guess you could say. And then that center piece there. Down here, more tactile volume tuning and climate controls, your heated seats, heated steering wheel controls, start stop capability, stability control. Uh, here are your power window controls. There's your front and rear axle locker. And that is really what makes a Rubicon a Rubicon, as well as the off-road plus mode and the sway bar disconnect there. You get four auxiliary upfit switches, your four by four shifter, and then of course the six speed manual transmission. A lot of people prefer the manual in the two door. And uh, let me know in the comments, which one you would, re what you would prefer. Everyone on YouTube seems to want that in these things. So this is our first two door with the stick shift at for 2024. So I would assume this one would go for fairly fast. This one also has the insulated hard up pieces. So this is actually kind of a foam with carpet on it to uh, absorb some of the noise and keep the heat in a little bit better. 
You also have assist and SOS buttons and auto dimming mirror. Another little Easter egg, you get seven slots on that piece right there. Home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. So I'm gonna turn on all the lights as promised. And then I'm gonna show you under the hood real quick, because this one does have the cold air intake on it. And I wanted to show you that. Um, going back to something I mentioned before, the those rock sliders or rock rails, those are an $875 option. And then under the hood, you have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. Once again, 285 horsepower, 260 foot pounds of torque, and 23 miles per gallon on the highway, 17 city, 19 average. So this is the cold air intake. Uh, basically grabs the air from up there. So if you are water fording or anything, you're not gonna be pulling water up unless it's over your hood, and then you're probably not in a good situation anyways, and then you get that air cleaner box right there. So that is that. There is the emissions sticker. And as promised, I'm gonna do a walk around here with all the LED lights on. But what I like to do in these videos is turn the lights off in the picture studio so you can see just how bright these are. So give me one second, gotta shut off all these lights. All right, there you go. It is pretty dark out already tonight, so uh, this is a very good representation and it's dark in the building already. So uh, this is a great representation of these LED lights and just how bright they are and how much they illuminate the front driving area of the vehicle. Very bright, very nice white crisp light. And as we go to the back, you'll see those LED tail lamps, definitely distinctive LED tail lamps. If you're following a Wrangler, Wrangler you kind of get that hourglass looking design on the back there and of course the LED license plate light. And then there was one more thing that I forgot to mention before. Apparently when you turn on the front windshield washer, it turns the back one on too. Uh, this one does have the hinge gate reinforcement by Mopar and that is a $675 option. Now, before we uh, end the video here, I'm gonna show you the original window sticker. Otherwise, remember that is linked in the description below. But if you finish the video, I'd really appreciate it, uh, just because we get a lot of recommendations if you watch the entire video. So uh, thank you again for watching the video. Let's go check out that original window sticker. Now, this is just a copy because I could not find the original one. It might be buried under all those boxes in back, um, but this is for this Jeep. So Hydra Blue Pearl Coat, black interior, Napa leather seats, 3.6 with the six-speed manual transmission. Everything on your left here is your standard equipment. Feel free to pause that. I'm not gonna go through everything, um, but it does start with the Hydra Blue Pearl Coat as optional equipment, which is $595. The Rubicon X package or 23Y is a $10,000 option. That gives you the power seats, the heated seats, heated steering wheel, acoustic front seal or seat area carpet, acoustic laminated front door glass, Alpine premium audio system, HD radio, the navigation system, the connected travel and traffic services, the Uconnect 5 with the 12 point three inch touchscreen, integrated voice command, Napa leather seats, and the body color Rubicon Highline flare, those are the fender flares, and the body color three piece hard top is also included in the Rubicon X package. Blind spot and cross path detection, automatic high beam control, park sense, integrated off-road camera, rear window defrost, rear window wiper, washer, hard top headliner by Mopar, freedom panel storage bag, and the steel front and rear bumpers. The dual door group with premium uppers is $3,550. And like I said, I was really hoping I could get those out and show them to you, but they are packed in there very good. All other floor mats are 170 bucks. The cold air intake is 525. The doors off mirror kit, which we did a demo on that. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen is $195. That's also linked in the description below. That's a really cool kit and probably a really good deal at 195 bucks. The heavy duty rock slider with step assist by Mopar is 875 and the hinge gate reinforcement by Mopar is 675. The worn witch is a $1,995 option and the Jeep trail rated kit, which we can't see because it's in one of those boxes back there is 195 bucks. 
Total MSRP on this one is $67,465. And if you want to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives on this particular Jeep, in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to this vehicle on our website to get all those rebates and incentives and, of course, availability. Three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain. There are your miles per gallon, your greenhouse and smog ratings, as well as your safety ratings, which Wranglers are always only rated for rollover, which is always three because they're basically convertibles. Anyways, there's a better look at that topographical format that's not all dirty. I really like it. it was a geography minor, so anyways. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Hope you liked it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and uh, to the YouTube channel as well. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we gotta go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at Summit Auto. If you wanna check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Auto. And if you want to stay current on our ever-changing and vast inventory, definitely click those bell notifications. You'll get updated every time I do a video. So you do not miss out on hard to find Jeep Wranglers like this one. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Jeep Wrangler videos I've ever done in the upper right, over 500 videos there, and a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this brand new 2024 Nicely equipped Jeep Wrangler Rubicon X two-door in hydro blue pro coat. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again. Have a great day.